Yo, yo, Red Gullius here. You are watching Wrench Feels Like Playing Kingdom Come Deliverance. Uh, we're back at it again. We're gonna continue on with the story here. Uh, last time I left off, I was kind of feeling trapped in this damn castle here. I couldn't find out, uh, figure out a way out. Um, I kept breaking locks, couldn't figure out how to lockpick, and just kind of kept getting pissed off here. So I did a little bit of uh, safe scumming and just kind of tried to practice lockpicking. Just trying to figure out the system and just figuring it out because I couldn't. So I kind of sort of feel like I have a, a, a good grasp on it a little bit here. It's not perfect, but uh, I, I think I can make it work. So we're just going to reload from uh, right after we got um, talked to from our uh, previous landlord, I guess, or lord. Um... And now, uh, we're just gonna restart, uh, from there. Um, I'm also gonna be a freaking asshole here, and I'm gonna start stealing everything I can. And selling it, too. Because there is a vendor here, um, that I can seemingly sell stolen goods to, as long as they don't know it's stolen. Um, you can sell it. So, I'm just gonna go through, steal a bunch of shit. Um, progress with the story here and, uh, move on. I'm not gonna try, I'm try, I'm gonna try not to spend too much time in here. My respects to you. So I'll just, uh, talk to him. So, Robard, I need to get to Scalitz. What would you do there, lad? Sigismund might have left, but the place will be swamped with robber barons, brigands, deserters, and other vermin. And anyway, your lord commanded you to stay here. My parents died there, and I won't leave them to be ravaged by dogs. I have to bury them. Good God, boy. Rep lost. Do you want to throw your life away for those who can never get theirs back? Do you think that's what they'd want? Forget it. Fine, then. Fuck you. Rafters are rotten on the north side, and on the south, the beetles have riddled them with holes. Damnation! That's a nuisance. It'll all have to be replaced. But at least the rest of the house is all right. Only that fucking roof. Well, that's some comfort, at least. Does that mean that there's, like, another option here where I could escape through... Good day to you. What do you need? Not what I was looking for. May the Lord watch over you. Is there a house next to the wall here that I can jump out of? Or was that just a random conversation that meant nothing? I kind of feel like that was something I could use. Everything here is like high up. Like, so I don't think I can just like jump out of a building or out of a window. Good health to you. I need to get out of here. And I need a feather bed with a comely wench in it. But it looks like we'll both be disappointed. Sir Divish gave orders not to open the gate, and you especially are not to be let out. <clears throat> My mother and father were left in. I know I've already done this, but uh, I have to bury them. I reloaded, I can't leave so them to the dogs. I'm sorry, to. my friend. Continue but I with can't. it. You'll have to persuade Sir Robard, or think something up, so I don't end up in the shit for it. Otherwise, forget it. What am I supposed to think up? How should I know? Maybe some disguise so I could say I didn't recognize you? If a Townberg soldier turns up all kitted out properly, in armor and a helmet, then of course I let him go. That's obvious. All right. I'll have a look around for something. Take care now. 
Well, wasn't that nice of him to just tell us exactly what we need to do to get out of here? <clears throat> Even advocating we steal. Isn't that crazy? Okay, so... I can just head straight to... The area I need. Oh, and there's no guard. I'm gonna do that right now. There's no guard here. At least currently. I'm gonna try this right now. I'm gonna duck, hide. I'm gonna try this. I really hope I get this within four locks. I still have the four lock picks that I got earlier. Come on. Come on. Just work. Just work. Got it. Dude. Yeah, I practiced for like probably a good hour. <laughs> like on this freaking chest. So I kind of get it. I know how to, I know what I need to do. It is still very freaking difficult to me. And I could not imagine uh, what the next tier locks are going to be like. Because if that's considered very easy, like holy shit, I don't think I'm going to be doing a whole lot of lock picking in this game. We'll, we'll see. Um, I'm just going to go and steal everything I can steal right now. And then we'll s probably sell it to the vendor. In there. Steal anything here. Those are hard. Very hard. Come on, there's nothing here I can pick. What about this? this Nothing. That's lame. Um, I think there's something above me, or yes. Steal a bunch of stuff up here. steal all that i'm overloaded so you move more slowly and can't fast travel run or jump okay so it's not too bad of a punishment here's some hard Hard. So I don't know if I get to keep the sword I have. It's a quest item, so it tells me that no, I don't keep it. So I might want to hold on to at least a, a decent sword here. Okay. I'm gonna... Stop sneaking. Where's the thing on the side there? Overloading. It just probably is the same thing. It just like carrying too much weight. Your maximum speed has been lowered. Place some of your stuff onto your horse's inventory or just drop something on the ground. And then, yeah, you can't dodge, jump, you walk slower. You won't be able to mount your horse either if you're uh, over a certain, like, half of your carrying weight. Interesting. But it doesn't do any damage to you. It just makes you slower and you can't do a lot of actions. But, okay. Nothing too detrimental right now. So I'm going to go to the vendor and sell anything that I don't think I'm gonna need and then head out I guess I probably could have went a different way but we'll go the long way okay, we're gonna head to the vendor Sure, it's this guy right here. Mark my 
Jesus Christ be praised. Trade. Can we trade? If you've got the coin. No, 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 no. You've got the coin. You've got the coin. <clears throat> okay. I want to check out inventory here. So, Sir Radzig Kobold Sword, the sword my father made for Sir Radzig Kobola. Damn, it does a lot of good stuff here. It's like 46 46 damage, stab damage, and slash damage, or 45 45. Minimum strength one, blunt damage two, defense 40, charisma six. Durability 25. Like, damn, this is a decent sword. And then I'm gonna go to like the other swords I have. Like, significantly less. Um, what about the 37 blunt damage? 44 and 44. Okay, so that's not. But like, why does my melee weapon like on the side there go like way down? Minimum agility eight, so maybe I just don't have the stats for it. So then my ability to use this isn't the, a, is half maybe. Is that how it is? Because I probably don't have an agility of eight. Where's my agility? One. Okay. If I feel like that's okay. Okay. Can we trade? If you've got the coin. Take care now. I'm gonna sell the axe. What else do I really need? The mace. I'm gonna keep the arrows and the bow. I'm gonna keep minimum agility eight. Like holy shit, that's a lot of stat points. Like I I feel like I don't know yet if that, if like how long that would take me to get to eight points of agility. Huh. Okay. Then minimum strength two, which I have. So I'm gonna hold on to a shield. I'm just gonna go with that one. So I'll sell this one. I kind of want to keep the reliable blade. Until maybe there's something else. It weighs 2.8. The bow weighs 3. I don't know how realistic it is for me to be carrying so many different weapons. Like, if I look at my weight, I have 74 carry weight and I'm at 62.5 with a bunch of armor. So, carry weight is going to be a harsh thing, and I'm going to have to use my horse when I get a horse. Okay, so the savior snaps is alcohol. So if you do try to save, you get drunk. That's crazy. Wow. Okay. And then I'm also wondering <clears throat> with the bow here. Is it like seriously like I have to carry arrows like i have to carry individual arrows like they weigh point 0.1 so if i had like a do I, they they must stack like if i had a bunch of better long distance arrows it would be like a stack of them right it wouldn't be just like individual ones that would be annoying but so that means i only have three arrows right now damn I feel like I'm like carrying a lot of shit right now. And my carry weight is like 62.5 out of 74. 
So I can only carry, pick up like what? 12.5? 11.5? Damn. But I do have armor now. It's just even though it's stolen, I still have armor. Okay, well, I'm just going to sell what I have here. You get 56. He only has 50 gold. Is there anything I want from him? Bandages? Lockpicks are expensive. Treasure map for 100. Like, no nah, thanks. For bandages. 4.8. Take another bandage. Or a couple. And then... I have a decent amount of food. I know it goes sour and rotten and shit over time, so I hope that's not going to be the case. If I go to my food right now... How do I tell? Energy, freshness, 75. 90. 80. So like, yeah, your stuff does go sour over time. I actually don't have that much food. How much does this cost? 5.7? I'll take some dried meat as well. I'll take two of those. <clears throat> Let's have a word about the price. Sure, why not? So let's see what he's willing to do here. Point one. Really? I'm I'm trying to understand here. Because I feel like I don't necessarily understand which direction I should be going in. I obviously want want more money, right? But the get, yeah. Original purchase price, trader's last offer, your inventory. Respond to offer if the answer is refusal. I'm just trying to understand, like, your current offer, too. Last offer not accepted by the trader, five. I feel dumb, but I'm not understanding, like, what direction I need to go in to make money and, or... If the slider can't be moved in one direction or the other, it means that... Your trader does not have enough money. You or the trader does not have enough money. The trader doesn't have enough money. Okay, so like... The down one is where I get money. <clears throat> okay, so now we're sitting at 35. I'm just going to haggle to 40, see what happens. He might get super insulted here, but... Is this enough? Close. Drop the price a bit more and we'll shake on it. I'll, I'll get that. 37. 40. I'll take it. I get two more gold than I, he would have given me. Very well, I agree. And I gained rep there, even though I'll probably never come back here, but... Sweet. Okay, so I stole some... Even, like, I can stel sell stolen goods as long as they don't know they're stolen. So that's good. Um, Can I just put the gear on right in front of them and just, like... Oh, don't mind me. You don't know who I am as soon as I put this gear on. Um, let's just go and... I just don't know the mechanics in this game. So I'm just going to go and uh, duck around the corner here. Put the gear on. 
Let's go. Okay. So let's see what I can do here. What do I need to do? It looks like probably all the stolen stuff I have, just put it on. So I'll go padded quaff, mail collar, light padded armor, hunter's gloves, decorated red waven rock, commoner bassinet. Is that all I needed? Why does the red scarf like seem like it stays on even if I switch to the no so there's a mail collar old boots <clears throat> hunter's gloves so these are all separate slots I'm trying to understand here Decorated red wave and rock. Helmet. So if I put on the red scarf, that would replace that. Right? And then if I go back down and go to red wave and rock, it would replace that. Okay. So I am armored up here now. Even though the helmet doesn't cover my face, which is hilarious. But we're gonna we're gonna go for this. Oh, I'm gonna actually mount a shield as well. Uh weapons. Let's go with the shield. Let's see how this goes. That's kind of hilarious that it, the helmet doesn't cover my face. I need to get out of here, I buddy. I need to get out of here. Then I'm afraid you're out of luck. Ah, I see. All right, then. But if you breathe a word about me to anyone. Farewell. Hi. Right. Is that it? Oh, yeah, motherfuckers. Peace. I don't know how I'm supposed to get a horse, though. I was probably supposed to talk to someone inside. You know what? I'm going to save here. I wonder if there's a way maybe outside here to get a horse. It's probably stables out here, but Oh no, they're closing the gate. Never mind. Never mind. Can I walk up to it? Are they gonna open it? Nope. Okay. So we're locked out. Okay, no worries. I was supposed to get a horse. Um, don't know if that's possible. I, I know there was stuff in the stables there, but I, I talked to, like, the stable guy, and he didn't, it didn't seem like I was able to, like, buy a horse or anything, so I don't, I'm not too sure. Um, we do have armor, even though it's stolen. And the sword. So sweet. Cool. Um, I think we're gonna have to just suck it up and walk to the scallops. Mm. Can't talk to the soldier. The game says I'm drunk. I don't get it. How am I drunk? When did I get drunk? Did I accidentally press, like, a save without realizing wonder if yeah if I'm accidentally saving without realizing it because I don't understand how I got drunk there like I am drunk right like that's what that symbol is uh How do I tell? Where is this? Yeah. Off oh, drunkenness. How did I get drunk? So yeah, I must have I must have accidentally hit 
save or something. I don't know. I don't... That sucks, because, like, you only have a limited amount of those saves. So if I'm accidentally hitting the save button, I kind of want to stop doing that. I'm going to have to take a look at the uh, trolls. <clears throat> Looks like I have a skill point that I can spend here. I'm assuming that's what the star... Maybe I'm wrong. Talberg, Renova, and then Scalitz is way over there. So my quest marker is an A. Zoom in. Interesting. Okay. So obviously, there's quest marker A. Damn, that's a long distance. Okay, we're gonna have to do this again. Sorry. Take a look at the map again. We just have to head. In the direction we're walking, I believe. And then I'm sorry, I'm going to have to check a look here. Just make sure I'm not hitting auto save here. I don't see an auto save button. I just don't necessarily understand why I'm drunk right now, and I feel like that the reason why is because I hit auto save, but or I hit save. Oh well, I'll get over it. Can we pick flowers? No. What with this flower? No. Um, near the road? This road, I think? Could be wrong. I might have to head up over there. It looks like I could probably get over here as well. A horse would make this a lot faster, I think. This is going to take a while. Can I cut through? What happens if I just start running? I wonder if I start losing nourishment faster and energy faster if I if I like continue to like sprint. I bet you that's a thing. Or if it's just energy is like an overtime thing just throughout the day. I kind of feel like this game would make it so like if you uh, exhaust yourself, that's going to expend some a lot of energy. Could be wrong. I saw birds. Well, this sucks. Having to, like, literally, I ran all the way here with a horse, and then I have to, like, walk all the way back slowly. Because I can't. No one's here. Oh, there's some people over there. Am I going in the right direction here? Is there a fast way to the map? No, I'm going in the right direction. Keep going. Gotcha. Is 
uh, like a mining camp. Whoa. Objective failed, get a horse. That scene. Looks like they've already gone. That's weird. That was weird. Because it looked normal, right? And then all of a sudden it cut scenes to a fucking desolate, burned up area. So it's kind of, kind of weird. I'll forgive it though. people. Whoa, what? I wanted to vent my rage on someone. What the fuck? Out of nowhere. Like, and I don't even have, like, why am I not armed right now? What the fuck? Like, oh, I can't, I'm so confused. Okay, there we go. You asked for it. Why did I ask for what? I didn't ask for shit, motherfucker. I'm gonna go up. Got him. What the fuck did you want, though, motherfucker? Um, I'll read the codex for a surrender, I guess. Kind of just. So, a surrender in combat. Life is God's gift, and combat doesn't always have to end in death. So when it's clear that a combat combatant is beaten, he always has the option to surrender honorably. And the honorable response is to accept his surrender. If someone yields to your mercy, it is up to you to decide how to deal with them. You can simply let them go, or refuse to accept the surrender and finish the fight. Another option, common to the Middle Ages, is to accept your opponent's surrender for a price. Either money or equipment. Okay. Similarly, similarly, you can also surrender in combat using LBA and hope your opponent respects knightly virtues. You can only surrender at a range of up to a few meters. If you will, you will always see the interactor. Interactor on guards, but not on fo other foes. Which doesn't mean you can't surrender. What? But your opponent can only surrender in range. Interactor on guards, but not on other foes, which doesn't mean that you can't surrender to them. Oops. What the? F Can't surrender to all adversity stuff. So what the fuck did that line just mean right there? Interactor. Like the command LBA on guards. But not on, like what? That statement to me doesn't make any sense. 
doesn't mean that you can't surrender to them. Does that just mean like that pop, like there's a pop up that pops up on my screen that says LBA when guards do this, but like if other people come, it doesn't. Like, I'm assuming that's what that means. Like, holy shit, that sentence, like, to me is like confusing as shit. Like, what is it? Like, I'm gonna move on. Uh, you can't surrender to all adversaries, though. For example, to bandits or humans. Neither will you be able to surrender to a mortal enemy with whom you've had a very low reputation. If you surrender to someone once, you will only be able to surrender to the same person again after some time has passed. Wow. Wow. Surrendering to guards. If a guard catch pole or other figure of authority challenges you to surrender or you or to agree to a personal search you can do so using lba but if you better decide quick because the guards of the law have little patient patient patience in these troubled times and won't hesitate to use force if you don't cooperate yeah because there's like a very quick meter for interactions at certain points so there is timed interaction things where you have to make a quick decision. That's rough. Okay. So you can surrender in this game. Release him unconditionally. Let him go. Disarmed. Continue combat. So this motherfucker just came at me out of nowhere. Like, he's acting like I was attacking him, it seemed like. Almost like he was he was defending himself. But the motherfucker, like, I just walked up on him and he just started to attack me. Like, I have no... Like, fuck you. So I'm gonna go and let him go disarmed. I'll let you go. But the weapon stays here. All right. We'll pick that up. Copy. Gather. You can pick up flowers. What the fuck? You can pick up a lot of them. What the fuck? Am I able to make drugs? That animation is kind of annoying, but. Buntly in fields and furrows as a bothersome weed. Oh, probably doesn't do anything then. Yeah, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop wasting my time. Hair, pretzel. Oh, freshness is really low. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. I have no shame. I will loot. I will loot. Probably am getting close to a carry weight though. Anything else I can steal? Is there a time of day? <laughs> Nothing I can steal? That's not cool. The weapon I just picked up. CX. Hunting sword. Hunter's weapon. It's not very good. Gotcha. Minimum agility three. 
My agility is only one, like, and those aren't even very good weapons, so it's like, shit. I think I have to level up agility, like, holy crap. I was kind of thinking strength, but... Might have to think about agility here. So, that combat wasn't too bad. Like, I didn't mind that at all. Low freshness. If it's below 50%, I'm just going to leave it. Take that. It's raining freaking hard, man. Why do all these people have so much food on them? Oh shit. Charcoal burner. Damn. All these people hanging from posts? Like, holy shit, dude. That's brutal. As I loot along my way. Hey! He's just looting. Why did anyone do this? What did these poor souls ever do to them? Just like me. Bandages. Like, I'm just as much of a looter as they are. So that guy just ran away. Is he gonna come back at me? Bandages, Groshin, hell yeah. I have no shame. Apple, 100%. Let's take a look at my stuff right now. I'm at 61 nourishment, energy 63. Try and see. Does it make me sick if I eat low freshness stuff? Certain foods cause energy loss. Oh, yep. Shit. What's that? Am I poisoned? Shit. Next time, be careful what you eat. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Shit. Your health is gradually depleting and so are your strength, agility, and vitality in proportion to the degree of poisoning. Holy crap. Okay, so don't eat fucking food that's not fresh. Kind of was testing it, and it definitely showed me. Damn, dog. Ay, 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 ay. Okay. What's going on there? Well, I never. The pig turns up willingly what the for the Why is it, like, pull my shit out, like, right away? You're dead, motherfucker. Yeah! Bring it on! Oh, fuck. Come on, my energy's down. Come on. Damn, energy depletes fast. That might be, like, one of the first things I have to try and level up. You dead? Mercy kill. Motherfucker. Huh. 
<sighs> okay. Um. See, he has armor. Negative one, negative one. Slash defense. Durability, low condition. So my stuff's in better condition. Okay. That's, I'm assuming, why defense and stuff is all different here. Yeah, so I'm not going to loot any of his stuff. I don't have much carry weight left. I have, like, 78 carry weight. Okay, so low freshness food is not even an option. Gotcha. Okay. I am a hoarder. I do like to check every everything I can loot. I'm going to try. It's pretty brutal though. I got to watch stamina when you're in combat. Like that's huge. You get like two attacks and you're out of stamina like or, like, you block once, and it's, like, freaking half your stamina. I got 200%. I wonder how recently these people were killed. There's probably a quicker way to get to my map. So I'm... Oh, no, I'm in Scallops. Oh, yeah. Parents got killed at the gate, didn't they? 100% and Groshin? Hell yeah, motherfucker. I'll take free money. 100%. 100, 100, hell yeah, dude. All this free food. percent fuck yeah loving in the barrels I can take no bandage Kind of confused. I don't necessarily recognize. I thought the keep was like on a hill. Maybe I'm just not close to it yet. Kind of looked like I was there on the map. And I see the A marker up there, so it's probably up on the hill here. There we go. I see this. I see it. I see it. I'm assuming there's probably going to be a couple more looters on the way. Brutal. I'm gonna take a look at the map. There has to be a quick way to get to the map. No, no.
Did I just miss it? What the hell? Oh. I feel like I missed it. Because I thought they died at, the, like, the gate there. The boat trail? Jeez, you're just taking the long way. Pretty sure this is the way we ran out. So I probably took like the long way around. Oh, fuck off. You gotta be kidding me. Are you serious? Really? I walked all this way for nothing? Fuck off. What a joke, dude. Wow. Fuck six. Man, when your endurance gets low. The screen goes all fuzzy, and you get all heavy breathing and shit. Like, it's crazy, the, uh, like, level of effect and detail it comes when it comes to just, like, everything in this game. So far, at least. Damn it. I have to, like, fucking run all the way back to the gate. Thought I was there, and it didn't allow me to do anything. So, upgrading your stamina kind of seems like something you need to do very early on here, if that's a possibility. I'm assuming if I walk to a certain point, I'm going to get a cutscene of some kind. I just probably missed the, missed the spot I was supposed to hit here with the front gate. crazy here? Like, what the fuck? What the hell, dude?
can't just jump over this lazy fence here? Like, come on. I know it's spiky, like, but come on. How the fuck am I supposed to get up here? Oh, there's people. Just assume they're looters. Hey, who's there? You're in the wrong place at the wrong time. You call that combat? Yeah. Ow! Yeah. Fuck off. Oh dear, did that hurt? Yeah. Fuck sakes, dude. Uh. Uh. Shit. 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 I'm not paying attention to my stamina. Is there a way to dodge? He doesn't have any shield or anything, so slashing or like poking like makes the most sense. Yeah, he's yielding. Disarm him. Leave that weapon right where it is. If you insist. And they don't have shields, they're easy to poke. And if I just let them run away, it's fine. I guess. Okay, yeah, here's the gate. Here's Louise. Probably gonna get a cutscene here if I guess. I don't see a sword. Unless this is the bailiff. I'm going to take all the money I can get. Brutal, man. Like, it's like hanging everyone. I'm just trying to loot. Eight gold? Fuck yeah, dude. Get some salami, some salt. Who the fuck was this guy? I wonder if he was like the traitor or something in this city town. Hell yeah. Thanks, buddy. I used to buy a side when we did to you. In the end, you were a hero. You didn't run away. You didn't abandon me like me. Assuming he's talking about his mama. I don't know how important food really is, but I'm just going to take everything I can get. I'm overburdened right now. I'm going to take a look at my inventory. Probably with the weapons as well. Like this guy right here, 10 gold. Probably can't sell it for 10. It's probably a lot cheaper than 10. Price is even less than that. I'm gonna drop this. Yeah. Okay, let's go to the gate. Here we go, cussing. Why 
Why did he do it to me, Father? Why? Why did you leave me? Forgive me. Forgive me for everything. Next time I won't run. I'll never run away again. I'll find the one who did this to you. I remember his face. I'll find him. All right, all right. I have to find the shovel and take care of you. I remember you told me you wanted to lie beside mother. Here. Under the linden tree. At least I can do that much for you. Find a shovel. We're gonna have to fight that dog. I'm pretty sure there's a spade over in the uh I hear dogs and a guy fighting dogs. No, it wouldn't be up here. I think it wouldn't really be that hard to find a freaking shovel here. Oh shit. Not you. It wasn't supposed to be you, Bianca. I'll find the bastards that did this to you. I'll find them. I swear it. Got any loot? This is a keepsake to remember you by, my dear. Probably a. Sh no, this is the bar, not a, not a shop. Come on, give me a shovel, damn it. Barn? No shovel in the damn barn? Are these worth anything? Come on, there's gotta be a shovel in here. Right there. Is that a rake? God damn it. What the hell, dude? 
Should not be this hard to damn find a damn shovel. There's ought to be one lead just laying around. Come on, man. Maybe up the hill? It's weird how I hear like this damn dog barking. I heard a guy fighting the dog, so clearly the guy fighting the dog probably died. I feel like I've gone in circles around this damn camp and I haven't really seen the damn thing. Give me a damn shovel. Okay, I hear the guy fighting the dogs. I hear it. I don't see it, but I hear it. Come on, dude. Well, there's the shovel. Get away, you mutt. Is that the kid I fought? Get away, you beast. What's going on? It's this what in God's name are you doing? What do you think I'm doing? Digging turnips? The beast just went for me. Isn't that Mutt the Butcher's? Mutt. Isn't that Body the Butcher's? Yeah, that's him. What's that got to do with anything? Well, seems like you fucking killed the Butcher. I'd say the poor creature is standing guard over his master. You weren't trying to get to him, were you? What do you care what I'm doing? Here? Or that. What are you doing? Here? I came to bury my parents. So bury them and leave me be. How did you manage to get away? How do you think I ran? Did you lend me that spade? I have to dig a grave, and I can't find another. What's it I see you have a fine sword. I'll gladly trade you my spade for that. How did you come by it? My father forged it for Sir Radzig. It's my duty to deliver it to him. It's not for sale. Yeah. Go right ahead. I was about to say. Dig that grave with your sword. See how that... And where will you dig it anyway? Here? You're not going to lay your parents in unhallowed ground, are you? Father said he wanted to be buried here, and I can't take him to St. James's. God willing, later I can find a priest to consecrate the ground. Do you know what happened to Teresa from the mill? When I fled, the Cumans wanted to... They meant to violate her. God knows what else. Oh yeah, I kind of forgot about no, that. No, I don't know. What do I care? They probably raped her and killed her like all the others. Her misfortune. Right now, I've got to take care of myself. Obviously, you're not meant to like this fucking guy. I've interrupted you robbing the bed. Is that why you're so ill-tempered? You bastard. Haven't you got a shred of honor? And what of it? The butcher has no more need of coin. And now that I think of it, your sword would do me quite nicely as well. Will you hand it over without a fuss, or Are you, you would end up like the butcher? Fucking serious? The only way you'll touch this sword is when I shove it in your guts. Are you serious? Oh, 
Oh, does he just run away? Sweet, he just ran away. Well, I don't like that guy anyway, so I could give a fuck. Oh, he doesn't have anything. What do you mean? Okay, so I'm encumbered. Is he gonna come at me, or did he just straight up run away? my parents um I guess I go bear uh, dig a grave something tells me it's behind this damn wall Yep. Probably that tree right there. Damn it. <sighs> yep. Better be the damn tree. This ain't the tree. I'm gonna be a little chapped. When I say a little chapped, I'm gonna be saying a, a lot chapped here. I'm gonna be pretty upset. Come on. This is a good place. Here we go. You're gonna launch. That scene? No. Start digging. There we go. There we go. Is someone coming at me? Or the puppy? Oh, is this my doggo? You get a dog friend in this game, and now is this my dog? Is he my dog? I'll take him. Damn, it's pissing out. Damn it all. How am I going to do this? Do you need some help? Uh oh. Is that him? Yes. Can't you see the sword? Who are you? What do you want? It's 
Bishek? Who do you think we are? Franciscan brothers? <laughs> We're to rob you of everything you've got. Especially that fine blade that's of no use to a peasant like you anyway. Banish the thought. It is my father's sword. You mean him? I don't think he's going to be needing it. Okay. Oh, it's a bigger fight. You hand over that sword. I Stamina, fuck. Like if not, you're in for a family reunion. You really don't. Leave me alone. Kill him, Rod. I cut the bastard down. Where's my shield? As you like. Could have just cost you a few teeth. Ah! Is it one on one? Probably not. Oh, where's my frickin' shield? What the fuck? Where's my fucking shield? That's bullshit, dude. Am I gonna- is this- am I supposed to fucking die here? I'm so confused. Where the fuck's my shield? That's bullshit. So this is where the, the weapon goes. I'm supposed to die here. That's fucking bullshit, dude. I told you how it would end. You should have listened to me. That was supposed to happen, I guess. This is nice work. That's fucking stupid. The chief is going to like it. It's new, isn't it? And now, for the maiden bloodletting. Surely your father never would have imagined it would be your blood. I believe there's a word for such moments. The old man would certainly know. But I'm just a common killer. Did you help make it? No doubt you did. Such miserable luck. To die by the sword you helped forge. Hey, go fuckers! Okay. <laughs> I don't like how that happened though. Like that just fuck man. Somehow like I all of a sudden didn't have a fucking shield. Like, I understand it's supposed to happen, whatever. Fucking like bullshit. That's bullshit. So the Theresa chick survived. And they came to save me. I, I don't know how that corresponds, like how that actually worked out. Obviously, like they knew I left, so they came behind me. I wonder where the Theresa chick came into the, the fold there. Was she just hiding? And where's my dog? There he is. And where's she taking me?
gonna give the sword back to Sir Gradzik. Hopefully we get, like, a decent amount of gold for that. I'm just assuming. Oh, we just passed through the city? What the fuck's going on here? Where's she taking me? What the fuck? Do you need some help? So, oh. mini rival, major rival type deal. It's a new day. Henry, can you hear me? Hallelujah. I thought you'd never wake. Were you having a nightmare? Yep. Uh, Teresa? Hmm. I still have a fever. Uncle won't be pleased, but you'll have to stay in bed. Well, that's not gonna happen. Where am I? In Scalitz? No. We're at my uncle's mill in Rattay. I didn't know where else to go. What happened? You don't remember anything? I suppose that's not surprising. I found you in Scalitz after those bandits attacked you. I thought they'd done for you. But you were still breathing. Why in heaven's name did you go back there? It was madness. We slaughtered everyone who didn't run. My parents. I, I wanted to bury them. I had to... Don't worry. I took care of it. Thank you. Any good Christian would have done the same. Now sleep. Sweet. You need your strength back. Alright. You're awake. Good morning. <laughs> it's near midnight. You've slept all day. Oh. <laughs> oh, I feel like a horse fell on me. The beating you took was worse, but at least the fever's broken. What in the world were you doing yeah, at Scalitz? That's my question Waiting right there. to die. What? They killed my brothers, my family, my friends. They're all dead? All of them. Everyone I ever loved. They killed one of my brothers in the mines. After that. What did I have to live for? Don't say that. There's always hope. No, there isn't. But it doesn't matter. I'm a different person now. Yeah. How did you manage to save me? You were lucky. I was in Scalitz and I saw Zbyshek and his thugs. 
I tried to distract them, but it would have been no use if those soldiers from Tamburg hadn't arrived. They were searching for you and scattered the bandits. Searching for me? Yes. Lord Divish sent them, led by Captain Robard. So tell me, why is a lord of such high standing interested in a blacksmith? So Divish promised Sir Radzik he'd look after me. But as for why they should care, I've no idea. Yeah, it's a good question. Oh, I'm exhausted. I'm not surprised. I'll bring you water and something to eat. In the meantime, rest. You're still very weak. I wonder if I lost everything I had. Like, that would suck if I, like, spent all that time looting for no fucking reason. Good morning to you. How's the invalid today? Ugh, I haven't felt as good as this since they lashed me to the wheel and quartered me on the town square. Got your sense of humor back. You must be better. My uncle will be glad to hear it. I had a job persuading him to let me bring you here. If you'd lain around much longer, he really would have dumped you on the town square. You can stay until you find somewhere else to live. But my uncle will want payment for taking you in and caring for you. I've been lying here long enough. Uncle will be pleased he's one mouth less to feed. But are you truly well enough? Well enough to do what has to be done. Where can I find Sir Radzig? He's in the lower castle in Perkstein. He's a guest of Sir Hannes of Leiper. But someone Perkstein. like you can't just walk up bold as you please and demand an audience. I know, Sir Radzig. And I didn't bring him his sword as I was supposed to. I must see him. If you insist. But you need to speak to my uncle first. You've been in your sick sure that's gonna for go well. a fortnight while he paid the apothecary to tend to you. And for medicine. That's a good deal of a coin you owe him. I've been lying here two weeks. My God. Better a fortnight in bed than an eternity in the grave. If it weren't for my uncle, you wouldn't be here at all. I guess I gotta get to work then. Fine. But right now, I have more important things. Oh, shit. To do. That's all you have to say? After everything we've done for you? No, that's not what I meant. Well, do as you see fit. That's not what I meant. I mean, I thought, like, you guys wanted me to do work. Hey, youngster! I'll come, come talk here. to him. Yeah. Started vengeance. Oh, yeah. A word Whoa. with you, young Where brother. are you going? Why are you guys, like, closing the door and you're asking for a word with me and you're, like, walking away from me? What the fuck? DLC activated. Treasures of the past. A legend has been circulating about statues containing magnificent warhorse armor. You can find more hints in your trunk. From the ashes. The long abandoned village of... Yeah, awaits the return of bustling life. Wait for a suitable opportunity and go see Sir Davish about it. Tournament. A combat tournament will soon be convened in Rate. It's to open it's open to commoners, so you even can enroll if you like. The Armorous Adventures of Bold Sir Hans Cavon. The local dandy has fond of intrigue. Especially when the fairier sex is involved, and the only matter of it's only a matter of time before he drags you into it. Band of Bastards. The province has been saved since the raid of Scalots. Hasn't been saved since the raid of on Scalots. And soon you can expect orders from Sir Radzik to raid to ride out with a band of mercenaries to put things to right. Woman's lot, you lost your home and family in Scalots, but you're not alone. Theresa and Jonaka encountered similar misfortune and led to and fled to. Each tries in their own way to come in terms with If you want to know more, look at the DLC heading in the main menu. Kind of instructions for playing the DLC. All of that is DLC. Some of that seems like that should have just been in the base game, but okay. A fast travel point. Got a dog. 
I'm gonna talk to this guy. Like, I don't m mind, like, helping out. My name's Henry. Thank you for taking care of me here. My name's Peshek, and I'm the miller here. You've already met my niece, Teresa. She took care of you for two whole weeks while you were in limbo. And talking okay, of you being death's door, while you were lying here, you worked up quite a bill with the blood letter. Yeah, you could have been... Who came now and yeah, thanks for saving me, but... God damn, dude. That quack doesn't come cheap. I paid him what I could, but I still... That is, you still owe him. I see. Well, it's better to be in debt than to lie dead in a ditch. What do I owe? I'm not afraid of hard work. You won't pay for that shoveling manure. I might have a better job for you. And it's not something any fool can do. If you prove to me you're a clever lad, I might trust you with something you could really make money from. What do you say? Yeah, sure. Whatever, dude. Well, what would you need from me? A trifle. Just to take something from someone and bring it to someone else. And not get caught while you're doing it. That sounds straightforward enough. I can't Except do that. for not get caught. Why would anyone want to catch me? Oh, don't worry. It's just a job like any other. Only this one requires, uh, let's say, the right moral disposition. Do corpses bother you? No honourable man should touch them. That's the executioner's job. Did you expect I'd give you a hoe and send you out to the fields? You can dig all right, but somewhere else. I want to know whether you're going to hide behind some stupid fucking scruples, or if you might be useful for more unconventional work. The fuck? What the fuck? Just out of nowhere, you just want me to come here and grave rob now? Like, what the fuck? I'll do it, but like, what the fuck? I was prepared for just about anything, but that's a bit much. Yeah. But go on. Tell me more. Listen, it's about this ring my mate Wojciech, the Kohelnitz Miller, had his eye on. Trouble is, they buried the ring by the gibbet along with the villain they hung while he was wearing it. Jesus Christ. You want me to dig up a corpse, take a ring from it, and give it to your friend in Kohelnitz? Yeah, that's pretty fucking nothing terrible. nothing sacred to you. Money first. Morals later. That fellow is dead. He won't miss it. Whatever bleeding heart came up with the idea that it's disrespectful to disturb a corpse never read the Bible. It's still a human body, only it's missing a soul. Why be disgusted by something created by God? That's fucked up, dude. But I'll do it. I think I've already heard more than I need to know. You've got the tongue of the devil himself. If you tried hard enough, I bet you could justify sodomy with a goat. Watch your mouth, boy. There's a shovel here around the mill somewhere. If there's any problem, come and see me. And here's something on the side to make you dig better. Thanks. I'll need it. I can't believe I've come to this. Digging up corpses. Oh, and uh, watch out for the executioner and his hounds. They're pretty savage. And I don't just mean the dogs. Yeah. You can just throw them some meat. The dogs, that is. But the executioner? Well, don't vex him. Farewell. Spirits. Get the dead man's ring for the pillar. Get a spade. Jeez Louise, dude. That's harsh. What the fuck, dude? Like, right away, like... Oh, you're awake? Go dig some fucking graves for me. Like, go dig up... Go grave rob. Like, fuck sakes, dude. That's brutal. Put all the things I had on me into a trunk. So I should have... So I do have everything I had there. Is this her? Have you eaten yet? No. Not yet. Well, try to eat something. 
A big lad like you needs his strength. Where's my shit? Ancient map. Holy shit. A lot of maps. And then everything I had, essentially. And more. There's a couple maps in here. Yeah, well, I'll take all. Blacksmith's son certainly wouldn't have been literate. To understand written text, you will have to find someone who can teach you to read. What the fuck? Reading was a very rare skill in the Middle Ages, and a common blacksmith's son wouldn't certainly wouldn't have been illiterate. You can open a book and try to make sense of it, of the glyphs, but in the end, you will have to find someone who can teach you at least the basics of reading. Once you've acquired the skill of reading, you should be able to make use of it. You can read descriptive books as you wish, but the true wealth of learning lies in skill books. Of course, it's not entirely easy to learn from books. To fully understand the text, you have to have a very good understanding of reading skills and reading books repeatedly. The quality of your reading is also influenced by the environment you read in. What the fuck, dude? Generally speaking, a place that's good to rest, oh, for fuck's sake, is also good for study. You can't tell you found a suitable place. You can tell you found a suitable place from the icon that appears next to your health indicator, a book with a plus mark. You can tell you found a suitable place from the icon appearing next book. Like, what? Like, fucking what? Okay, so you, you, you can read books, but you have to be able to read books. You have to learn how to read books from someone else. One. And then two, you have to be in a good area to read a book. You can't just fucking read a book. You have to, like, go to a place. Like, a bedside in a room. Jeez fucking Christ, dude. What the fuck? Okay, sure. I'm over encumbered and hungry. Eat from pot. I'm not hungry anymore. You learned Chronicle. So I'm wondering if it's these ancient maps. I can read that. Interesting. But I'm wondering if it's those ancient maps that is kind of referring to. Do I have a book? No. So I'm assuming it's the ancient maps he was kind of talking about in that. Interesting. Um. I have 54 nourishment. Eat again. Drop into pot. That can't just eat again. I got my shit. I have to find a spade, and I'm over encumbered right now. Damn it, dude. Drop the bludgeoning weapon. I'll drop... Eh. I don't know what I should really drop here. Condition 16%? Holy shit, dude. Oops. So 
100% quality there, 84 there. Green shirt has 75. Hunting gloves, fine. But the padded armor is like pretty much done. Really don't have very much inventory. Anything here spoiled? Don't need the roast duck. Why am I weighed so much? Like, what's weighing me down so much? Necessarily understand what's weighing me so much right now. Is it all the food I have, or like I, I know my armor obviously is gonna weigh some, but I wasn't this encumbered beforehand. So why am I so encumbered right now? Damn, dude, what do I have to drop? If I go and just put stuff on here, so if I go helmet, padded armor still has more defense than the shirt there, so I'm going to keep wearing it. Warhorse Gamblesome. That would be where my weight's coming from. Gotcha. So I'll put that on. Comfortable Knight Gamblesome, commonly used as a lower layer under heavy armor. I'll wear that, and I'll take uh, and I'll deposit this padded armor then. Sweet. Well, at least I figured out where my weight was coming from. I don't know where I got that. Am I stealing that? I'm gonna drop off the padded armor here. Ah, oh, fuck off. Damn it, dude. What the hell? I gotta breathe. What the hell, dude? Okay. So I'm not very conspicuous. So I'm gonna have to change when I want to go and dig. Got a dog. Is that my dog or what? But he said there's a shovel around here. I can't believe I have to fucking dig a fucking grave. Would have thought there was a shovel in the barn there. Is it on my map and I'm just being ignorant?
So that's A. I need B. Where? Really? A is over there. Cloudy area. Quest giver. How do I frickin' zoom in? Is this zoomed in? Dude, this is annoying. So that's zoomed in. I feel like I should be able to zoom in more. He made it sound like there was a spade, like, right here, somewhere. Man. Why do they gotta make things difficult? Oh, fuck saves. Um Go and need a spade to dig up. Get a spade, B. So, okay, I keep accidentally fast traveling here. I'm, I'm just trying to zoom in on the map and understand where the fuck B is. Oh, like I don't want to fucking fast travel. There's A right there, clearly. B is just not a thing on the map. It's just kind of like... I feel like there should be a B pretty close by where I am. I just can't seem to zoom in here. This is as zoomed in as it gets, I guess. Okay, yeah, so this game doesn't... Obviously, it doesn't freaking just, like, hold your hand, obviously. But at the same time, it's like, there's... N it's not very intuitive. Like, you would think... I'm like looking around here going like okay so you would think there was a shovel in like maybe a barn here or like but no it's like no no you're gonna have to very very much so search for a damn shovel great is it just by the grave just walk around until I find something, I guess. Like, I don't feel like I'm gonna find a shovel just walking around on a cliffside here. Like, I would have more, like, probably found one I don't know. In a barn? Next to a house? I'm not going to the right way.
just looking for locations where a shovel would be. Seemingly, I'm not getting it right. Like something the cat dragged in. Yeah. What actually happened to you in Scalis? I mean, during the attack and. Well, you know. That's a long story. Not a very cheerful one. Are you sure you want to hear it now? I guess, sir. I do. All right then. It was a day. Day like any other. Another ordinary day in my ordinary life. <laughs> I awoke at first light before the others. I like those kind of mornings best. Yeah, I didn't ask for like an entire backstory. Sunshine, Jesus Christ. You drive away the nighttime cold. Oh, hello, you. Come here. And the breeze carries the scent of dew covered grass and the bloom of spring. I wanted to get my chores done before the rest of the household was up. And this morning seemed made for that very purpose. I don't think this is what I asked her. Right, better get to work. I have to feed the hens, weed the garden, feed Tinker. I'd better get it all done before Papa is up. Are you serious right now? Are you fucking serious right now? I don't want to fucking do this. I'm sorry, but I do not want to fucking do this. Look what I got for you. You'll love this. Okay. What the I just wanted to fucking... Am I like... What the fuck, dude? Okay. Sure. This is fucking stupid. I just wanted a fucking shovel. Now I have to do chores. Like, what the fuck? I didn't even mean to click on the dog. It's just in my way. Oh my god. Are you fucking serious right now? I'm sorry, game. This is fucking stupid. This is this is stupid. Like I'm I'm sorry. Like this is this is fucking stupid. I did not ask to do this. Like uh Holy fuck, dog. Get the fuck away from me. I'm like already doing something I don't want to fucking have to do and it's like making it even fucking more tedious. Like, are you fucking serious? Okay.
that should do it. The garden is looking how it should again. Okay. There's this little asshole. Okay, where are the chickens? Okay. Here, chicky, chicky, chicky. Here, here you are, girls. Fill your beaks. Like. I'm sorry about complaining about this, but this is just stupid. Like, this is not what I wanted to do. Like, holy shit. I didn't realize that fucking just asking her a simple fucking question was gonna, like, completely derail what I was doing. Um... I must bring Tinker a piece of meat. That'll be a nice treat. Okay, well that dog was all over me. Now I can't fucking find him. Are you fucking serious right now? Where the fuck is this dog? What the hell, dude? Look what I've got for you. You'll love this. Okay. Are we good? What do you need, Papa? Go up and see the blacksmith. He made some nails for me. Here's some coin. All right. Anything else while I'm at it? No, unless you want to stop off at the market and buy some supplies. And I don't. Go wake Sam. I really don't. The boy's still lying in bed and won't stir. You ought to follow your example and Stebor's. You two don't have to be pushed to work. Well, at least he's still better than that good-for-nothing's Bishek. The lazy wretch. A helper like that isn't worth a damn. If it weren't for his father, God rest his soul, I'd have thrown him out on his ear long ago. Aye, he's an idler, that one. And he'd hardly give you the time of day, never mind a kind word. God will reward him in kind one day. Mark my words. You could tell him to get his ass to work, too. Right. Go for nails, send Samuel and Zabishek to work. If it's at all possible. Aye, just so. Oh, and Teresa, once you've done all your chores for the day, I have a little surprise for you. I'm struggling to give a fuck about this. Like, I really, like, why do I fucking give a fuck about this at all? Really? Now you've got me curious, Pa. I'll be on my way then. Now what do I have to do? Yeah, 
yet. No, I'm just gonna go straight to the blacksmith. This is stupid. Like, I didn't ask for this. Holy shit. Where the fuck do I have to go here? Um, this way, I guess. Like I say, you're like a wretched sheep that will go where it's told. Even slaughter. Don't save you, Captain. Holy shit, come on, let's go. Like, am I gonna have to go through this and like entire cutscene? Like, damn it, dude. Like, this is like a whole fucking mission, like. Holy crap. Like, I... I'm struggling to give a fuck about this. Like, this is stupid. I'm just gonna go to the blacksmith as soon as possible here. Hopefully this will end quickly, like, fuck. I hope this isn't, like, some sort of, like, long-winded fucking mission here, like. Or something I'm supposed to really care about. Um, wrong way, yeah. It's... it's No sign of the blacksmith. Where can he be? Please just fucking be in the house. Please just fucking be in the house. God save. What can I do for you? Father sent me to pick up nails, but there's no one at the fort. I uh, sorry, lass. Martin had to go to the castle to talk to Sir Radzi. He's yep. to forge a sword. Can you just give me the nails, please? Oh, I see. And has he made the nails for Pa? I'm afraid he hasn't had time on account of that sword. But if you come tomorrow, he'll surely tomorrow. Have I'll remind him this evening. All right, I'll stop by tomorrow. Do Holy that, fucking shit, oh, dude! By the way, the girls were looking for you. Which girls? Bianca and Johanka. You should stop by and see them before you go home. I don't give a fuck. Be plotting something. What was it about? They didn't say, but it seemed important, which probably means boys, I suppose, hey? Don't talk to me about boys, good wife. I've three fellas at home, and that's Bishek at the mill. You get more use and less fraying out of a donkey. <laughs> you're very sensible for your age, lass. This is like a whole on I'm fucking thing. I'm sure you'll thing. change your mind when your pa finds a good husband for you. Cool. I'd like to know where. Thanks for letting me know. I'll stop by tomorrow for those nails then. Not at all. Oh, and another thing, Teresa. Have you seen Henry around anywhere? If he helped his father out more at the forge, there'd be no shortage of nails. I haven't seen him at all. No doubt he's at that sword play with that so-called combat master again. If he could wield a hammer half as good as a wooden sword, there'd be no shortage of nails.
Well, that's where we're going to end it today. Um, didn't realize I was going to get myself into a, a completely different fucking thing. Don't really care to fucking do this, but okay, I'm just going to... I'll continue this next time, but uh, if you like what you see, feel free to drop a like and subscribe. It would really help my channel grow a lot. I really appreciate it. Until next time. Peace.